Okay, now five minutes for medit. <clears throat> First, uh, correct your motivation. Um, <laughs> we should generate a positive motivation for living beings. And think something like, I'm going to meditate so that all beings will be free from self-grasping and attain enlightenment. So we have to kind of uh, uh, generate this kind of positive motivation. Um, once you establish that motivation, then uh, same as like yesterday, you visualize um, uh, spiritual teachers is inseparable from Buddha, Shakyamuni Buddha, <clears throat> in front of you. And then um, after that, we say this... Uh, Prayer. So the prayer, page nine, and number nine, the nature of mind by Mepham Rinpoche. <clears throat> so One time we say this prayer and then I will tell you what to do next. Page nine. Okay. The nature of mind by Mapam Rinpoche. Mind's nature is indivisible, emptiness and clarity. Expressible and indescribable likes. In seeing it, there is no separate one who sees. There is but a single encompassing sphere. Even looker and looking are one and the same. This view of seeing all wounds and past. past. Keep that in mind, and then now <clears throat> um, just relax, and you should look at your mind, and then relax on it, and uh, enter more deeply into the experience of uh, self-awareness, self-arising wisdom, and relax on that. just to remain in the present moment. If your thoughts arise, then you should visualize our teachers and um, Buddhas again, inseparably, and focus on their blessings, and then try to relax again on your self arising wisdom for five minutes, please. Mm -hmm. 